Hello, my name is Storm Porteous and I'll be performing Jesse's monologue from Your Money's Worth. Well, believe it or not, but sometimes my life sucks beyond the time of it. And I don't understand why me trying to kill myself makes you want to buy me new clothes and clean my room. Buying new clothes isn't going to fix clinical depression. You're asking me to tie a ribbon on a gunshot wound. And you know what? I didn't come in here and say fix me. I work. I work every goddamn day. I get myself to class when I want to just kill myself. I held on jobs. I got to work when I would have rather gone home and drank bleach. I made friends. I helped through times of crisis. Heck, I even dated. Oh. Hell, I work, and you don't know me. You don't know what my life's like, and you cannot blame me for wanting a way out. I'm not aware of the patient you treated, okay? God, stop treating like an age group, I'm a human being! You know what? Usually I make another appointment, cancel it, and ignore your calls. But I've stood up to you. And that's huge for me. I've aired my grievances, you refuse to acknowledge them, and now I'm done. Well, one of us is insane. And for once, it's not me. Great. Hello, my name is Storm Porteous, and I'll be performing a monologue called Wrong and Ready. I have just come up with the best theory. Teenage life sucks. That's it. Once you reach 13, your whole life goes pew, pew. I mean, all the adults say I love to be a teenager. I'm sorry, this isn't the Sunshine 70s anymore and they're just trying to make us feel better. And all the kids say, oh I wish I was a teenager, it must be so much fun to be older. No, it isn't. So in middle school and all sides happen, right? For some strange reason, once you become a teenager, all your friends decide to turn against you. I mean, at first it's usual, hey best friend, you hang out and stuff, but as soon as you go, they go around gossiping. Like, oh my gosh, did you hear that Gretchen made out of Justin in the movies last night? Oh yes, it was definitely Tom. I don't even know Justin! And then, in this high school, the black hole of all teenage life. Once you get there, your whole world turns upside down. First off, everyone expects you to be this pencil thin stick. And if you're not that thin, you're considered fat. But even if you are that thin, they go around spreading that you're anorexic. And all through high school, it's college this and college that. And the college counselors aren't any help either. They're all like, you fail, you lose, you suck, you made my eyes of fairies. Would you like fries with that? I hate them, I wish they'd die. Where was I? Oh yeah, last second. No. I'm tired of complaining. <laughs> now I only have two things to say. One, adults, you're wrong. And two, kids, get ready. <laughs>